seen. Hello guys, this is Yundel again. Today I want to share with you how to receive. Yes, receiving, there is something in that also. Because maybe we are just thinking, yes, I receive it and just say thank you, then it is done. But receiving, you must be clear what you are doing. To receive, we must open and loosen our grip on life. And we must surrender our heart to the giver. So guys, receiving is also about being grateful of what you have at the moment. You must be grateful. You acknowledge it that this is your blessing. Be a good receiver. How to receive? Receive it with an open arms with gratefulness. We thank you, thank you, thank you all throughout the day to our blessings. There is always blessings, guys, that come day by day, which is not aware about it. But if we acknowledge it, we are grateful on it, we know in that certain blessing that that is for you and it's there for you, around you every day. Guys, Get super clear about what you want when you ask something. Because if you are specific what you are asking, you receive it what it is you are asking. Just simply be specific. Get clear what you want in your life. Get clear what you really want. That is life, guys. But we must be specific. To tell God or to the universe what you really want. So it can deliver to you and there is the receiving. We must ask. We must know first what we want. We must ask. We must believe. Then we are capable of receiving. Right? So guys, it's, it's also here. We must declare our dreams and desire. In order to receive. You know what you want. We must also know and acknowledge that we are ready to pursue, to be in our dreams and desires. What you're dreaming of, what you desire, it will come to you in its perfect timing. But you must clear that is that one you want. Guys. We must declare it and affirm it what we want. The dreams and the desire. Be specific what kind of dreams you want to fulfill. Wrap ourselves up in the desires daily. Daily, guys, we must wrap ourselves in a desire daily. It's like about having an excitement every day. It's very important, guys, that we are excited every day. We feel happy and joy, and it helps us to go through. It helps us to boost our energy, confidence, and self-esteem. So it's Caesar, guys. Wrap up yourself daily with good confidence, with good self-esteem. Uh, self that can help you to go through and cultivate the attitude of gratitude. This is very important, guys, and this is very powerful that we can create what we want. We can create what we wish in our life. And it says here, we can cultivate it and use of it. Acknowledge that the universe is waiting for you to say yes. We must say yes to everything, guys. We must learn to say yes that this is for me. I am ready to receive. You must acknowledge it. You know what you're asking. You know what you're believing. And now you are ready for receiving. How to receive it? By being aware, by being mindful what you are grateful at the moment. Therefore, it's very important that we can say seven times, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. It's very important that we can speak it the, four, the seven thank you many times in a day. Guys, 
Yes, this is about being aware that you are ready to receive. You must feel that you are ready to receive in something. You must give your feelings about it because it says, guys, in the law of love, this month, there must be an action, there must be an excitement. The more you are excited, the more you feel happy and joy within your heart, the more it is easier for God, it is easier for the universe to deliver what you want. So guys, keep on dreaming. Keep having the desires within you. You are capable of doing things. I know it is not easy. I'm still working with myself. I don't have a good child background. I am having difficulties on some of the messages, which is very difficult for me to deliver. But it is what it is. It is life. I am here for a reason. I am here to serve you. This is my message. Sharing with you some food for our mind and soul. We cannot function well, guys, if we cannot appreciate ourselves. We must feel love in order to give love. We must receive the most loosened and open grip on our life. To receive with an open heart is a surrender to the giver. See, we must surrender. We must humble. We must humble ourselves in order to receive. There is energy in everything. There is vibration in everything. The law of love is all around us all the time. But we are not experiencing it. We don't, we did not feel it. But if you practice the power of meditation, the power of prayer, just feeling there alone with your own thoughts, it will come to you. It will create in your mind because what you are thinking, it will come up. What you are asking, it will come back to you as well so guys this is my share about how to receive because many of us is taking for granted just receive it and say thank you sometimes guys thank you is not enough i must be honest we are a human being that sometimes thank you is not enough even the, is the person say thank you and thank you to you many times it still it is not enough Especially if somebody are criticizing us, our colleagues, our co-workers is criticizing us. It's not really a good feeling, guys, for ourselves. So, guys, here it is. I am sharing with you. Get super clear what you want. Clear as a water. You must know what you really want. To receive is something good, you must get yourself onto a good high frequency level. To glow yourself to the goodness of frequency, we must think good, we must speak good, and use the good words. And take good actions say take good actions and all these things our mind our heart is clear for receiving when we have spoken and we have discussed this thing that that is the thing you want to have at the moment we must remember to think the good thoughts we must remember to speak the good words and we must remember to take actions towards our goal Yes, I am not perfect. I have my own weaknesses. I am slow in my reading. I want to move forward. There is something. There is a hindrance for me. I don't know why I cannot just forward with my education. I am really slow. But I have to accept it. That, that is all I can give at the moment. Because it says here, we cannot give which we don't have. We must give when we have. So guys, we must declare always be a part of your conversation every day about your goal, about your plans. What is your plan from now up to five years? Such things, guys, it's worth thinking for. And we can only think clear if we practice the 
power of meditation, the power of prayer. It becomes clear as water, guys, that the Holy Spirit is within us. So therefore, guys, I hope that you understand my message. This is just my share. I am not a psychiatrist. I am not a therapist whatsoever it is. I am just sharing with you from my own reading from the hospital I was bent why I learned all these things. There are so much things to learn in life. So guys, I hope you will continue to be grateful for the blessing you receive. How to receive? We must practice the attitude of gratitude. Cultivate it. Nourish it. That you are a receiver as all. Well. Be a good receiver. We must be grateful for what we have at the moment. We must be grateful that great things can still happen to us. Because I believe my later days will be much better than my former days. I am specific that my later days, that my future is brighter than now. So guys, how to receive? Always feel it within your heart. Follow your guts and instincts. Believe what you're believing for that can make you happy. Don't do it for other people. It doesn't work at all. So guys, do it for your own sake. We can do this together. Think of yourself. You are a good receiver. We must use in order to, to receive. It's Caesar, a good receiver. Think good thoughts. Speak good words. And take good actions. Again, guys, this is Yundel. I hope you like my message. And I hope you will continue to follow me as well. Please click the like button and the notification button so you are notified every time I am sharing with you some videos. Guys, this is a life journey. You and me in this together, we can make it. Blessings will come when we believe it. Be specific what you want. Again, guys, this is Yundel. I love you so much and I thank you. Bye-bye.